This is CNC World, a new perspective. The 70th Venice International Film Festival wrapped up on Saturday. For the first time in the Venice Film Festival's history, a documentary won the top Golden Lion Prize for Best Film. Lifestyles takes you there. The documentary Sacro Gra, directed by Italian director Gianfranco Rosi, was one of the two documentaries in competition at the 17th Venice Festival. Rossi tells the tale of Rome's giant ring road, or the Gras of his country, filming the lives of a dozen characters there for over two years in a minivan. Jury president and iconic Italian director Bernardo Bertolucci says he thinks that all the jury felt the poetic force of this film. He says it was a sheer desire of the jury's members to see a really surprising movie as a winner. The winner of the Silver Lion for Best Director was picked up by Greek director Alexandros Avranas for his Miss Violence. It tells the story of the terrible manipulation carried out in a family twisted beyond repair by poverty and despair. The film's protagonist, Thames Pano, won the Best Actor Prize for his role as father to a family, which holds back a deep secret in Miss Violence. The award for Best Actress was given to 82-year-old Elena Cotta for her role in Via Castellana Bandinera by Italian director Iman Denti. Filomena, directing by Stephen Frears, won only a Best Screenplay for Coogan and co-writer Jeff Pope. Although it drew rounds of spontaneous applause when it premiered at the Venice Film Festival. The Venice Film Festival is the oldest festival in the world and has just celebrated its 70th edition. The festival also celebrated its second annual market, where many foreign sales were made this year. The competition section had a jury of nine key film figures of various countries, including Chinese actor and director Jiang Wen, and was chaired by Italian director Bernardo Bertolucci, one of the most respected directors in the history of cinema. A total of 20 titles disputed for the Golden Lion at the world's oldest film festival, which ran from August 28 to September 7 on the Lido seafront in the Italian water city. The festival opened with Alfonso Guaron's 3D film Gravity and closes with Amazonia in 3D as well. This is CNC World, a new perspective.